Hey everyone, I'm here today because there's something crucial we need to talk about. There's an urgency in my voice because it's about our future, our children's future, and the world we live in. Donald Trump has been a name on everyone's lips for years now. But as we approach another election, it's vital to reflect on why his leadership could be detrimental to the very fabric of our democracy. Let's dive right into it. Under Trump's presidency, we saw policies that favored the wealthy, leaving the average American struggling to make ends meet. Healthcare became less accessible for millions and educational inequalities soared. Is this the direction we want to head in again? But it's not just about domestic policy. Internationally, Trump's approach has often alienated our allies and emboldened our adversaries. His unpredictable decisions on the global stage have made the world a more volatile place. Do we really want to hand him the reins again, knowing that global stability is at stake? Think about the environment, an issue that affects every single one of us. Trump's administration rolled back countless environmental protections. He pulled us out of the Paris Agreement, turning a blind eye to the global consensus on climate change. We need a leader who prioritizes our planet, not one who ignores science for profit. And then there's the matter of character. The highest office in the land demands integrity, empathy, and a commitment to justice. From derogatory remarks to divisive rhetoric, Trump has often shown us who he is. Can we afford to ignore that? I know this is a lot to think about, but it's necessary. This election, think long and hard about the kind of future you want to build. It's not just a vote. It's a statement about the world you want to live in. We need leadership that brings us together, that strengthens our communities, and that looks to the future with hope, not fear. This is bigger than just one person. It's about all of us. So let's make our voices heard loud and clear at the polls, for our future, for our families, and for our country. Thanks for listening. Let's make the right choice.